Hello folks, Kyle here, Dark 30 Outdoors. Hey, today, today is gonna be an adventure. I made the long trek from my house over to Salt Fork Lake at Salt Fork uh, State Park. This is in uh, southeastern Ohio, just, uh, just east of Zanesville, about 20 miles. It's a beautiful lake in the hills of southern Ohio. Um, the water clarity looks amazing. I've done a, a couple loops around this bay trolling. Um, today I'm after musky. This lake has a great reputation for muskies, especially really, really big muskies. So today I'm after muskies again. I'm going to be trolling again. I'm hoping to put a big muskie in the boat, but I don't know. Hopefully I'll bring you some fish. Stay tuned. That's a nice fish, but I have a I don't know how I can get this fish in. This is a real nice fish. It's a shame I got everything to fall up. Oh, Jesus. Stay right here, fish. Stay right here. Scoop her. If we can get her coming this way. Saw that net and she said I ain't doing that dumb shit either. What a messed up tangled mess. I didn't get that other line out of her out of her road quick enough. But woo! We got one. Can I get this out of you? Oh, you are my first salt pork muskie. Yeah, 36 and a half inch Salt Fork Lake 
Musky, baby. She's a beaut. Let's get her back. There she goes, there she goes. Woo! Love it! Uh oh, another gig, another gig. That is a nice fish, folks. That's a really nice fish. Oh, shit. Please tell me they're really good. I don't know. I can't really tell. Oh, man, this is a big fish, folks. This is a big, big fish. Holy moly. This is a big fish. She's gone. Oh. Oh. Damn it. Oh. Damn it. She jumped, kicked, threw it. Oh, that was a big fish, folks. That was a really big fish. That, that was a big fish. That, that, well, that was a big fish. God, I was just getting ready to scoop her. That's got me shook up, folks. That's. That fish was 46 plus. Thick body. I mean, a thick body. That. I gotta get going again. We're in the major. That's. Can't be worrying about that. Oh. She broke that lure. That's how she got away. Did she do that? She had this in her eye for a minute. The back hook was right in the corner where you want it. Look here, folks. 
That's a that's a Bagley DB6. She, the back hook was right in the corner of her mouth. She broke it off. Now I know why people like uh, baits that are through wire. Well, folks there you have it I I had a feeling that today was going to be an adventure uh, this was only my second time ever fishing at Salt Fork Lake um, I caught my first Salt Fork Lake muskie so uh, I'm pretty pretty thrilled about that very tickled to have caught my very first Salt Fork Lake muskie now there are only three uh, Ohio program musky program lakes stock lakes that that i have not caught a musky out of but scratch salt fork off the list i caught one um the, the big one that got off um i i never would have believed that a musky would tear the hook out of a lure um i know a lot of musky lure makers uh, specifically make them uh wire through so that the wire goes all the way through the lure and I always kind of felt like that was a little bit unnecessary, but uh, my mind has been changed today. Uh, any lure that I invest in in the future will, will almost certainly be through wire. It cost me a, a, a big fish today. That, that fish was big. I mean, the back on it was, oh my God. I don't know how long it was. Uh, if I were to guess without looking at the footage, just staring at her beside the boat, I don't know, 47, 48, maybe bigger than that. She was maybe bigger than that. Um, if I'd have had anyone with me, she she could have been scooped. She was beside the boat for two minutes, maybe more. Uh, again, I'll review the footage, but uh, that was an epic fish, man. <laughs> uh, I got the other line out of the way. It wasn't a problem at all, like it was for the first fish. Uh, that was kind of comical. Um, they don't call it Esox Chaos for nothing. Um, that's a, the name of the old boat here, Esox Chaos. There's going to be a little chaos. Uh, I certainly had that today, but but it was an adventure. I had a lot of fun. It was a blast. Um, I hope you enjoyed the the footage, the trip, the adventure, all it was. Uh, this rendition of Dark Dirty Outdoors. As always, thanks for watching.